The GBI is investigating how a woman in the custody of Hancock County deputies ended up in a coma at Grady Memorial Hospital in Atlanta. Camila Williams tells us what happened when a Sparta family called for help for a daughter in need. If I had known that it was going to turn out like this, God knows I, I wanted to call them to come and get her. And Mary and Marvin Greer didn't expect their daughter Brianna Greer to end up in a coma. I just broke down and, and cried because it, it, it's just ridiculous how she landed up there with tubes and pipes everywhere on her. But no reason, because it didn't have to be that. It didn't have to be that. The incident happened right outside the Greer family's home. Brianna was having a schizophrenic episode, and they called the Hancock County Sheriff's for help. When two deputies came, they arrested her and took her away. But it was the call they got the next morning. That's where they were shocked. Chef Terrell came out and told my wife that uh, she uh, kicked the door out and jumped out the car. GBI Special Agent Mary Chandler confirmed that the car was moving when Brianna got out. But the family isn't buying that story. If she got out of the car, they had to let her out of the car. That's my interpretation because if in a, in a police car, you can't open the door from the inside. So it had to be open from the outside. The Greers tell me Brianna had hopes of being a veterinarian. She was so in love with animals. They say this wasn't the first time she had an episode, but it's never ended this way. Now she's in the hospital with a coma and a fractured skull. The way I'm feeling like they didn't have to do that, her like that. Marvin Greer says they just want to know the truth. I would do what any other parent would do. And that's what we're trying to do now is find answers. And the only answer they want to know is what happened to their Brianna. In Hancock County, Camila Williams, 13 WMAZ News. The GBI confirmed they are investigating the case and that Greer was airlifted to Grady Hospital in Atlanta.